Hey guys, it's Marlene for ABC Family, and tonight we're at the world premiere of Disney's Maleficent. I'm super excited to chat with the stars of the film as well as the stars from ABC Family's new shows premiering this summer. Let's go catch them on the blue carpet. I was a big fan of fairy tales as a kid, something like that, and to see Sleeping Beauty told from like the other person's perspective, like from the evil side. I shall bestow a gift on the child. I feel like our Sleeping Beauty is definitely more modern. She's stronger and she actually shows emotions. Curious little beastie. I know you're there. Don't be afraid. I am not afraid. The journey of the film is not dissimilar. I've, I've been dark, I've been hurt, I've, I've gone walls up and angry and changed. And, and then children have uh, softened me and opened me up. You kind of got to get into it at some point. I think my mom dressed me up one too many times during the week as a princess. <laughs> I have it in my blood. <laughs> I'm her I'm a raven and she turns me into a man when she wants to have conversation and she can she turns me into whatever sort of animal she likes really we've been waiting for this movie I mean they've done all the other movies uh, the Snow Whites but we haven't done Sleeping Beauty Sleeping Beauty was always like the scariest of fairy tales for me as like you know the Disney versions because there was no redeeming quality about the witch she's just like evil well it's simply a mistake to ever have a character that is purely evil or, you know, we are capable of being fierce protectors and we are capable of, of deep, deep emotions and, that, and our emotion, I think, sometimes is seen as our weakness and it is absolutely not, it is our strength. Fight with me now! She got those horns on, the little black horns, they scare me. <laughs> That's a wrap on tonight's blue carpet, but don't forget to catch Disney's Maleficent in theaters May 30th.